All right, so you just won your third world championship. How does that feel? Phenomenal. Um, I mean, two is great, and coming in, um, you know, of course that was a goal, but you know, you never know what can happen on race day. The swim is short, and the conditions, it's windy, you never know. So, I mean, I'm telling you, coming down that shoot, I'm very passionate about this flag right here, so um, pretty phenomenal. So, I mean, was the were you what were you expecting from the course today? Um, you know, it was actually days? better than I expected. Um, I was nervous because the swim is usually my strength, so the fact that that was shortened quite a bit, maybe a little bit nervous. Um, you know, you got a headwind, we had a tailwind, we could so kind of average out and I mean the crowds people were still out there on the turnaround I mean I was one of the last waves to go so one of the last ones out there I mean the crowds are still out there I mean I'm pretty pumped. <laughs> and you've been um, you've been a Paralympian uh -huh. on the swim team. You've been per participating in triathlon for a while. And yeah. What does it What does it mean to you to see the sport grow like it has over the last couple um, years? We, we need it, and to see to have this be the largest group of para triathletes in the world to ever come and compete here in Auckland uh, compared to last year in Beijing. I mean, I hope the momentum continues to 2016. We need the people. We need the competition, and um, go USA. And it, is is 2016 a goal for you? Um, you know, year by year. I I love the sport, but I think so. Okay. Um, one of my teammates just crossed. All right. Great. Yeah. Thanks. Congratulations.